Hello everyone, this is me, Satya here, and I'm back with the bonus love read. This reading is going to be for the sign of Pisces. So the topic of the reading is what is going to be the future of this connection. Whatever connection that you have with your specific someone, you really want to know what is going to come for the two of you in this connection. This reading will definitely help you know that. I will be adding oracle cards in this reading as well. So stay tuned. And uh, before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it is a general read. It may not resonate with everyone out there. So always pick the signs and messages that resonate. So I'll leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that are offered as well. So fishies, let's see what is going to be the future of this connection. Whatever connection that you have with your specific someone right now, uh, let's find out what's going to be the future. Let's begin. Page of Pentacles, Four of Swords, <clears throat> Five of Pentacles, King of Cups. It seems like, you know, whatever connection that you have with your person, um, if and only if you don't listen to other people around it, your situation is not as bad as you stop thinking about it to be. Like, for instance, if you are with your specific someone and if you live in the moment, I don't think that there is much of the issue there. But if you start getting worried because of the future or because of what, what people have to say to you around this connection, you start worrying around it. I feel like, you know, um, I do see that coming through for, for you in this connection. Um, I feel like, you know, there is this uh, need to have uh, an official announcement in regards to this connection that you have with your person. Uh, you would want that to happen. But if it doesn't happen, what you have is um unpleasant feeling about your person doubting them their intentions doubting uh, if they even have feelings for you or not so i feel like um in in, in the times to come um again if if you could ignore what people are adding to the situation things will stay stable balanced and happy but somehow i feel like you know you're you are going to feel influenced by what people will be talking about it your connection with your specific someone they will be putting fear in you around um is it going to work out are you just wasting your time stuff like that so for some of you maybe it's the people telling you for others of you maybe it's like you know you assuming that you know what are they talking about me like you know uh, i don't want this i want people to know that i'm committed and i'm you know with this specific someone so maybe you you are wishing to uh have that um official announcement to uh to it you really want that and if it doesn't happen you're gonna start feeling bad but again it's something that you're assuming and then thinking around it there is no such thing as maybe they don't want it or maybe they they don't have feelings for you but just that because of you obsessing about the future or how you want it to be you will start making it uh look like bad and then feel bad around it so um but if you could ignore that Things are pretty much stable. Things are pretty much on the right track. But yeah, let's see what else is coming up for you. Justice, Knight of Pentacles, King of Swords, Ace of Wands. Um, if, if you could go easy on yourself, easy on the connection, uh, you will be getting justice. Uh, whatever justice that you desire or whatever outcome that you desire in this connection, you will get it all but somehow um you got to have um patience i feel like you know things are going to be go uh, going to be you know moving forward slowly uh so you have to kind of you know keep yourself um strong around the situations uh if you stop overthinking over analyzing every bit of it uh that is happening in this connection you are going to trouble yourself uh, nobody else is going to get affected but you yourself so you really have to understand that to get what you want you really have to believe that whatever you desire is possible you cannot just uh, be you know um, feeling fearful 
and then wishing for something to come true it will never happen that way i feel like you know the the most um important thing here would be to try your best to keep yourself patient try your best to keep the negativity or influence of other people out of this connection and to live in the moment believing that what you desire is something that you will definitely get without any fearful thought um so that's what you need to do and um, the rest will happen um but yes if you get fearful and if you start picking up argument fight with your person because they are not giving into connection they are not talking to you much they are not committing to you just yet they are not making it official just yet then you will have trouble with your person because i feel like you know it's just because you are being fearful it's gonna attract you more reasons to be fearful of uh, maybe they will stop talking to you maybe they will start ignoring you or something to do with that but if you really can go easy on yourself on your on your person as well you will see some uh, beautiful changes coming ahead you might start something beautiful with their person not just that you would also have uh, your person expressing their love for you their feelings to you as well so it's all depending on you how you are taking the current situation how you are dealing and reacting to the current situation will determine the future for this connection that you have with your person underneath the deck we do have two of cups the love is definite here in this connection but yes you got to stop letting people confuse you and stop letting your need to you know keep um make this connection move to the next level um kind of you know just just you need to slow down there and uh, no matter how long have you been in relationship with this person try to still be patient with them um i do see that you are on the right track but yes you got to stay uh in the moment enjoy this time together and you will see beautiful future coming ahead for the two of you so let's see some oracle cards here let's see what the oracle has to add to the read for you guys <clears throat> So we do have this could be the one you have already met the romantic partner you seek this person could be the one if you really want to have a future with this person but yes you got to stay patient uh you got to live in the moment and uh, you got to stop being fearful and now uh, one more card healing family issues your love life benefits as you forgive your parents for some of you maybe your parents could be the one who's kind of you know forcing you to get into a relationship which is committed and official so maybe that's going to be the issue there. Maybe you are going to feel pressurized to uh, to take certain decisions in your love life uh, because of your family. And uh, maybe because of, uh, for others of you, maybe it's because of the family situation that you have dealt with could be the reason why uh, you are finding it hard to stay positive in a situation like the one that you are in where your person is not giving in. Maybe you are kind of, you know, getting fearful. What if uh, they leave you, especially if you have had a, um, you know, um, family life which was uh, you know where, where you always seen this uh, you know unfaithful partner or something like that be that coming from close friends or family or something to do with that so maybe you have your own fears and you don't want to be one of them who um who got cheated on uh, you know later on after having a lot of time spent together so maybe that fearful thought is what kind of you know uh making you feel um not so positive for not getting this connection uh, official just yet so maybe that's you know it's, it's I feel like you know whatever you desire um, you will have it if you stay patient but at the same time you got to control your fears around it um, try to be patient try to be a, a believer in this connection because if you are believing in this connection that it is meant to be trust me it will be one last card we do have let go of control issues allow the situation to unfold naturally like I said earlier everything that you desire with them will happen but you have to allow it to happen don't try to control everything don't try to pressurize them to commit to you don't try to um make them do something that they are not sure of right now just allow things to unfold naturally don't try to pressurize your person um so yeah that's pretty much it coming up for you for this uh read if it helped you do like share and subscribe till i do the next read for you guys take care and bye bye